Hello, Gateway to Technology. Mr. Chow Miller here. Um, the drag worksheet was a drag. No, it really, really was. It was horrible. Um, I got a 60% the first time I took it. Then I got an 80% because I've got an account for both classes. Um, but yeah, it's really horrible. Uh, I don't know what to tell you, except I'm not going to count the drag worksheet in your, your grade. I'm going to give you a grade based on the average of all your quiz grades. But I will... Maybe I'll just add 10 points or 20 points to each person's total because that drag worksheet was difficult to follow the coefficient of friction and convert the the numbers. And it's, you know, it was tough. What I want you to understand is the ways to reduce drag, and that is to reduce your um, frontal area, which is the part that's zooming right at you. And you can do that by making a smaller bottle. So if you have gotten, let's say, let's make 15 seconds the... Uh, the baseline. If you've gotten 15 seconds or over, I'd like you to try to redo it with a 1.25 liter and see if you can still get 15 seconds. Um, that is kind of what we're going for because if you understood the drag, whether or not you got the questions right, if you understood what they were trying to show you, it's that by having a smaller um, bottle, you're going to do better. So please go ahead and make a new rocket with a 1.25 liter bottle or a 1 liter bottle and see if you can get that to work. And I think you'll find some really interesting results. Uh, today I want you to read recovery and do the recovery quiz. And believe me, it's a lot easier than the drag worksheet. Okay, thank you.